Chase here, and thank you for watching. I'm in the kitchen, um, again, and um, I'm cooking. You guys know how much I love to eat. I mean, that should be a uh, testimony to that. But um, you also know how much I love to work with fried rib dough. Um, you, if you've watched some of my other videos, you might be familiar with Barocco's and uh, cinnamon sugar butter crisps and the cinnamon sugar butter twists. Well, I've got some fried rib dough right here. It's pretty good. I like it a little bit more. It has a little bit more run to it than that. But <clears throat> I want to make something called a hog bite. My boss gave me a, uh, a ham. Uh, hell, I'll even show it to you what's left of it. Gave me a bone-in ham, fully cooked. And um, I've been eating on it for about a week now. Um, cutting the meat off and then frying it in the pan. And I have some right here. Now, I don't know about you guys, but I like my bacon crispy. I like my ham crispy. That soaks up a lot of the flavors from the fats that are melting back into the meat and it just gives it an incredible flavor. So what I'm gonna do is, with this ham that I've fried, I'm gonna roll out my fried bread dough, about roughly in like a tortilla, and then I'm gonna put some of the ham pieces in there and then fold it over in deep fried, fried bread. And tomorrow, I'll see if I can't get some uh, blind reactions to it. Uh, if I think it's that good, mm -hmm. <laughs> if I think it's that good, I'll probably make a video later, um, giving my reaction to it. But, hog bites. As always, thank you for watching, and I'll talk to you later.